I'll probably do that after we finish up this university. Was there a way to get out of here down here? Probably not. Also, make sure there was no knowledge nuggets. It means that 29 our new room are still for 130 each. Yeah, that seems like a... I mean, unless I'm... Ah, here we go. A unless I'm misreading that, that seems like a pretty good tr trade amount. But, and I want to see how much of the uh, room... Aram. Probably Aram. 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 Aram sounds more like it. I wonder, let's see how much that takes to unlock a new, like, weapon. I don't even know why I want to unlock weapons so bad. Yeah, so it only takes 400. It takes 30,000 of these to unlock. And again, I don't even know why I want to unlock other weapons so bad. I can't really even use them. Which is, again, a very bizarre system. Wow, it really put us out here, didn't it? Th uh, their maps need to do that thing that WoW's map does. Like, when you very first open it, it pings your location. So you can go, ow, oh, that's where I'm at. All right, let's sprint back in. I want to get all these quests done. So I'm thinking what we're going to do. First, I'm get my phone stand straight. Is finish up the quest here and maybe head back to the base. Maybe check out the auction house and all that. And then I'm probably going to stop streaming for at least a little bit to get some food. And I might start uh, streaming again later. Because I kind of want to get wrapped up with Secret World. Like get to a point where I'm just like, okay, I feel like I'm kind of done. And it's not to say I'm not enjoying it still. I am. But. kind of want to mix it up a bit. You know what I'm, know what I'm saying? Alright, so we got those three quests. Damn, and he's got four quests. Crazy Town, USA. This might actually take longer than I thought. So he might end up going back sooner. I didn't realize he had four quests. The faculty. The situation at the academy is dire. Past faculty members are rampaging the grounds as specters, and the headmaster recognizes that they might reactivate an old war golem. If that were to happen, it would be a most catastrophic situation. It's imperative to stop the specters before they get that far. The faculty specters have the power and knowledge to reanimate a dormant war golem. They must be stopped. Find the record of interred faculty members in the Bursar's office. At least the war golem's still in formaldehyde. Ha. Huh. It's funny you should mention that. Funny. Comical. Or funny peculiar. I don't really understand the phrase. I was auditioning it for future personable conversation. Mixed success, then. We have all seen the reanimated corpses of recently deceased staff. Felt pathos at those once great minds leaking from vacant orbits. I think I'm gonna be sick. You're covered in blood! I also witnessed professors of an older vintage making their agonizing way through the halls. Historically, many faculty members were convinced to donate their mortal remains to the Academy ahead of their untimely deaths. For the betterment of knowledge. I believe their knowledge is now being perverted by some vandalous hand. That's a cool, I love that model. One that plays them like fleshy puppets to access areas most forbidden. We possess an Illuminati war golem from the 1600s, purely for reference purposes. The school records of its last activation make for gruesome, albeit entertaining, reading. Such an activation would require... A full faculty meeting. So, dear this God, will get worse before it gets better. Oh no, I shouldn't think it would get better. I like you. You know, yeah, I think my hair is clipping through the the head. Let me take that off. To uh, and also, is that low key like you wanting to get uh, order food? I, I'd be actually down with that. I was like, man, like I look way different than I thought. Oh wait, that's not me. I haven't unlocked anything else, have I? No, whoa, 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 hold on. Because if we order something, you know what I want. What I really, really want. Oh yeah. 
Looks like those, uh, what are you, what are those, those glasses that, uh... Oh, I can't, I went around shirtless. Something for the ladies. All right, fine. Holster pants with buckle? Oh, wow. This is a fashion travesty. But yeah, I'd be down for some Chinese, to order some Chinese. But that is literally every single day that I've been alive ever. Not Google Glass. Um, they're like gaming glasses to keep you from getting a headache. I think they're still around. Ah, what's the name of those damn things? Gunners. Gunners, yeah. That's them. I totally got my gunners on. Though I actually think that I have heard from somebody who I would trust. Uh, said that, that she uses them uh, when she gets migraine or gets headaches from too much computer use. Uh, she said it actually does help. And I think they were gunners. They look like them. They're very, very similar. Looking. I've never had that problem, luckily. Oh my god. If I had issues from looking at the computer screen too much, that would be like being allergic to dairy products. I just wouldn't even want to live. I did see something. Oh, I saw the orange. Hello. Oh, it's the headmistress again. I guess I can murder you again. Fine. Oh, she heals herself. That's why. It's a bit of an endurance fight. Order Chinese, mm, sweet, sweet Chinese. Oh, there's a knowledge nugget. Gotta grab those, obviously. Let's zoom out a little bit. Oh, let's zoom in. I want to see her. Oh God damn it! She's dead, and I got all this shit all over my ass. I got shit all over my ass. That's usually not good. Professor Brent. Yeah, I'm guessing uh, this is probably for the quest. We're going to have to come back and kill this guy again, I'm sure. This guy's going to die and re-die a million times. The geometry room. Eliminate Professor Crockenballs. <laughs> Crockenballs. Great. I'm sure he didn't get made fun of when he was growing up. Damn it, I can't tell your balls away from mine. <laughs> I like how they just kind of float in the air. To the defensive magic room. Why are they suddenly... Oh, here we go. <laughs> yes, exactly, damn. All right, let me zoom in again. I want to see some of these guys up close and creepily. Yep, I want the Kung Pao chicken. With the, with the chili sauce. Not the red sauce, in case we get that person who... That one person who doesn't know a red sauce doesn't mean sweet and sour sauce. Damn it, his specter come back. Come back to life. Parapsychology. Nope. Don't. Don't. Because we're just going to have to kill her again anyway. Nope. No! I don't want to wait on your respawn too, damn it. Pain in the ass. Thank you. Alright. So if we can time this right, we can, uh... This is a bad time to do this. All right, so go in here and now kill her. Okay, <laughs> it all worked out just like I planned. Got blood magic. Ouch. 
I thought she's still alive. I was like, what the hell? Occult history. Oh, come on. There we go. Whoa, creepy. Look at it. Face. Don't be healing. I ain't got time for you healing. back on. <laughs> I throw her out the window. Nice. Weird. But nice. The summoning lab. Heh. <laughs> Killed by the shield. I wonder if I had to kill those. Summoning lab, is this it? Yep. Try to find the living one. Here. There we go. Alright, let's wait for our health to come back, just in case. This is one of those ones that's tanky. All right, Professor Jones and me. Professor Jones and me. Oh, nice. My like shielding destroyed that like instantly. Damn it. It is one of these. Blood injury. I need everybody energy. Y'all need to stop healing. You are uh, ruining my flow. Go to the alchemy lab. Shielding. Damn it. Yep. There we go. Oh, you're still alive. Damn it. Not getting too close. Um yeah, what I'll probably do is Visual just Visual tracking initiated. Visual tracking initiated. Basically, I'll, what I'll do is I'll stream and then eat and then uh, start the stream up again. I don't think we even need the visual thing. I think it's fairly obvious where this thing's going. Yeah, the combat is, um, like it's serviceable, I guess, you could say. Wait. It looks like it's going this way, sort of. Wait, we just went into a circle. No? I feel like this is a circle. But yeah, like it's serviceable, but I don't know. It, it doesn't feel like it synergizes that well. Like, for example, so you have the two different skills that you're theoretically supposed to be using. Yeah, we just went in a circle. All right, let's try this again. Um, but anyway. Like, you have this whole blood mechanic, right? Where it's like, oh, well, you do more damage when your corruption gets higher, but you take more damage, blah, blah, blah. So I was like, that's cool, but you don't really get a chance to use it because you run out of blood power and like it goes down so quick. If you use your other school abilities, your corruption just ends up dropping. You don't really get to take advantage of it. Maybe later on it, it does, but 
All right, let's wait for these little things to pop up. Because despite me saying earlier, you don't really need them. It's not really being very clear because it's... Whoa, what? What the hell is that? That was weird. Anyway, oh, the formaldehyde stains, not really the blood stains. Wait, what? Why would I want to use it? Or how would I use it? Oh, okay. Weird. The stains are going all over the place. I don't really... But anyway, yeah, so you don't really even really... The whole corruption thing doesn't even really enter into it very much. I mean, I guess if you really just really made chaos, like chaos my secondary and only had one ability being used, then I could see it. All right, so... Okay, here we go. But then your secondary becomes a lot less cool, which, I mean, again, you know, it's... Or usable. But, I mean, it is a secondary, right? So it's more of a... It's theoretically more of a backup. So fair enough there, I suppose. I might have to take a relook at our like look at my skills while I'm uh, like eating skill points and stuff. Oh, hello, Bill Blows, Byblos, the vampire, the zombie gender, vampire. Jesus Christ! I'll just make up words. I don't care. That is eight percent power left on the phone. Yeah, I would say maybe I'll be generous and say an hour after whenever ever I go offline. Hopefully sooner than that. All right, let's see what this side quest is. A mysterious book titled Hexes and How to Avoid Them is discarded near the Innsmouth Academy roof. Its knowledge should be stored in a more secure location. A book about hexes and ways to protect against them has made its way out of the Innsmouth Academy library. Best to return it to the library before someone unsavory makes off with this knowledge. Not like us. Pick up the book. It's a big book. Return it to the library. All right, we're going to switch back, though. Action Sabotage is what these are called. How are you doing? Ahem. I was too close to the door. Oh, this seems good. War golems have the power. Something, something, war is dumb. Come on, shotgun. She's got a shotgun. No, yeah, she's got shotgun and pistol, it looks like. Nice. Teamwork! Honeycomb. Oh, shit. Hey. I don't know if that was actually supposed to happen. I feel like that, like, phase or whatever spawned, like, right afterwards. Alright, we will... <laughs> okay. Alright, let's move so that the generator doesn't respawn and attack us. Whoa. The deuce was that. Cool, a war golem. You just tore out a little page of vivisection history. It's one less show and tell for the kids, assuming school isn't out forever anyway, but no big whoop. Those things were a product of their time, a time when stitching together cannibal giants was a show-off pioneer spirit. Automation and the necessity for a good return on investment put that to bed. Now targeted assassination is so much less squishy. Fun fact, when mechanical seg was introduced, we did run trials on restarting flesh golem manufacturing. It didn't work out. Got some weapons, which is good. Damn, takes a lot more experience to level these up now. Damn it! Ghostly Janner. Oh, this is just factory. Alright. Uh. What was I doing? Oh, right. Gonna upgrade the belt some more. Oh, we have a necklace to upgrade too. 
Oh, and another weapon. Oh, no, no, no. That's right. That's the one we're keeping. Alright, gun it. Sounds good. I do want to do that at some point. Whoa. Oh. Shit. That's obviously confusion because uh, my controls were backwards. That's a good debuff. What the hell? Hmm. Yes, I was going to say something's going on. I think it was happening to that other person too because she kind of stopped when we ran out. Okay. Unless it has something to do with that book. Ah, it does, I bet. Let's uh, like make that quest the uh, marked quest. Really quick, let's get rid of this book. Because I feel like picking up the book itself. Apparently, the number one secret of avoiding hexes is don't pick up books that talk about getting rid of hexes. Raised familiar. Templar scum. Turn to the book. Alright. Can we just like drop it on the ground? Feels like this is what I want to do. Oh, here we go. Excuse me. Sweet. Good reports have received. <laughs> Here I'm like doing the same attack over and over over there. Nice level six waistband. Critical empowerment results. Nice level nine still though. All right, now let's head back again and grab another one of his quests. Hello? Hello. Hit him. Keep fighting the good fight, or whatever you believe you're doing. Why can I? There we go. I had to be up in his shit. Science and the arts. Creatures of the occult, demons, and even some people were laid in the very foundations that keep Innsmouth Academy standing. All to provide enema for the wards to protect the school and Kingsmith from everything that lurks outside and inside the walls. Now the walls themselves are leaking enema and creatures are breaking free, leaving the school vulnerable. Examine the campus blueprints to find out where the enema caches are. They should be in the headmaster's office. To teach the gifted is the highest form of our sciences and arts. Believe me. I have made exhaustive studies of them all. Necromancy is a dog and pony show. Demonology? Please. Leave bargaining with the hell dimensions to the chancers and masochists. Galimetry is brutish puppet work and recollects my days of medical practice. They were curtailed. But my humanistic focus was not shared by the founders of this grand institution, this great experiment. It has been said that there is a skeleton in every closet here at Innsmouth that is simply not true. They were laid into the very foundation walls. The basement might bleed if you chipped beneath the plaster. That's a figure of speech, right? I'm sorry, Carter. Oh my god, have you ever heard of a white lie? The architecture was exacting. A pattern, a focus, a tomb, a battery. Stockpiling anima from many sources, not entirely willing sources. It would be politic to close the breaches before they emerge. The first time you get bricked in is probably the worst time, eh? From my research, it seems each time begins a claustrophobic eternity anew. You're like the world's revenge on sarcasm. Do you know that? <laughs> Uh, eyes up, doctor. My eyes are up here. Jeez. I Study blueprints in the headmaster's off office. Education. Is that upstairs? That's not, or is it in here? No handshakes, please. Body temperature makes my skin crawl. Now, there he goes. He said that again. He said it. He said the thing. No, that's, okay, that's administration. 
So headmaster's office is upstairs then. Yep. Yeah, good. She's already dead. History of accidental drownings. Containment grid. Okay, sure. I'm sure I'm sure that's all important. Go to the dorm. Hell yeah! Party! Woo! I was never into that whole, like, campus life thing. I, actually, I was going to live on campus, but I had a, a ferret at the time, actually. And, uh, there were, like, no pets, and I was like, alright, well, piss off then. But I also went to, like, to a tech school, so it was mostly dudes. And I, uh, I worked during the day. So I get, so I ended up going to school mostly at later classes, like five, six, seven o'clock. So of course it was mostly old, like to me, old people, which is now you know my age, which is depressing. But basically, people who work during the day and uh, went to school at night, which again, like professional people do. How the shit do I get? Oh hey, oh this is the quest to get close enough. Anima leaks. Would you proc? Damn you. Oh my god, you will not proc that last thing. There it goes. Jesus. That's the RNG for you. Sometimes it's proccing like crazy, sometimes not so much. Um, thank you. I think the other ones were behind as well. Feels like we closed one before we had the quest back here. Maybe not. All these brick walls look the same. Hello. That sounded proc like crazy. Well, we did. There we go. I love how I'll use in pretty much any MMO, like seal leak or disrupt ritual or begin a ritual is like wave your hands in front of that thing for a few seconds. Hack computer, make make uh make typing motions with your hands about three inches above the keyboard. Now you've hacked the computer. The other thing is there's not a lot of, like, I don't feel like there's a lot of synergy between the abilities. But, like, between different schools of abilities. Like, for example, that one passive we have for, uh, for blood magic. It's the one for malefactorium or whatever, where you do more damage if an enemy is dotted with a blood ability. Uh, it has to be a blood ability that it's dotted by, right? So, like, you don't get that extra damage if it's dotted by anything else. It's like, oh, well, it kind of makes it, me kind of, again, very restricted in how I can use these abilities. Which, again, I realize that, you know, the combat's obviously not the highlight here of this game. Uh, it's supposed to be around the story, which is nice. It's definitely a nice change from freaking most MMOs. Though, again, I've heard Final Fantasy uh, 14. I think that's the right one. Has a lot of that too. I keep forgetting to use the tab to heal too, damn it. I've never used that, like, at all. I'm like level 23. It's shameful, I know. Get them, boys. When those proc, it actually they do some pretty good damage. I'm gonna grab this before I forget. Check the old block. Will do. I like this academy section. It, again, it, I like that there's an MMO in current times. 
so you can see more. I mean, obviously, schools aren't necessarily a modern invention, but you get what I'm saying, like as opposed to like warlock schools or you know, I don't know what you would have in uh, in other games, but you get my drift. I'm doing a bad job of explaining it, but and I and I'm somebody who like doesn't ever. I don't like, don't feel like I'll ever get really tired of fantasy, like. I've been like playing fantasy stuff for years and years, and I've never felt like okay, I'm kind of done with fantasy. Like I just like the setting a lot, but I also like to see different stuff. But I don't necessarily get tired of that one. But I'm kind of the opposite on space. Like I, like I don't dislike space, I guess, but it's fairly low on my list of of things that I like, I guess. Alright, one more around the old block, apparently. Alright, old school Magus, Magus, damn it. Every time, like, she spawns it right as I'm trying to cast the ability at her. I don't even know what there's not anymore. We've, we've sealed them all up. Ah, oh, there, kill them. I'm thinking about going back to putting my blood weapon in my main hand. The damage isn't actually too bad, but it's less than the fists. So if I have to resort to a like a normal attack, I'd rather use the fists just because it's more damage. And the blood AE is going to do more damage just because of corruption too, right? So we can have like swapping them out, like the base damage of the two AEs, the blood one and the chaos one are the same, but the blood one will do more over time because of the corruption buildup. Obviously it will also damage me, but... But that's okay. I feel like there's going to be some knowledge... Knowledge honeycombs at the top, like on some of these roofs. Oh, we also have two messages, I forgot about that, the bottom right. I need to check that when I can. Um, okay. The funny thing about running through mobs and not fighting them is because we're in combat, it actually that will, uh, gives us some chaos sometimes, or the paradoxes will be generated. Is it? On, I'm going to guess it's on the inside then. All right, let's check the messages before I forget. Kristen Geary. This is more of a nice to have, but you know, sometimes it is nice to have things. Kudos. Uh, oh, okay. I don't know what that was about. An invitation to be our benefactor. Greetings to you, most prestigious of occultists. In light of your exemplary work out in the field, we'd like to extend to you the invitation to be amongst our most honored benefactors. We look forward to seeing you at the Honesty Yard in London. Hmm. Okay. No idea what that's about, but I'm assuming that's like breadcrumbing us to a new area? Because I think London's the headquarters for the uh, Templar. Could be wrong on that. I think New York is is Illuminati. Templars in London, and then somewhere else for the dragons. Where are you at? Well. Oh, oh, oh. This is it. Derp. Oh, hey. How you doing? She like ran up to me and was like, oh, I'm supposed to do something, aren't I? Damn it, again, they always spawn right at, at, as it's ending. Or maybe this isn't it? Oh, 
Ah, so London is is the Templar. Okay. I have to say, as much as like, I mean, I like Asian culture to a point. I mean, I'm no weeaboo, but I like you know Asiany stuff. But I gotta say, okay, that's this is obviously not it. Um, I have to say, like the dragons are the least interesting group to me in this, at least in this game. I don't know if they just didn't sell it to me or what. Uh, let's try a different level. No, it's wait. Oh, it's downstairs. It looks like. Hmm. I don't even remember how to get downstairs. Shit. Actually, no. Wait, you can't get downstairs. That's like a separate instance. So it's got to be outside, right? Uh, God damn it! Do you remember how to how to get outside of this damn school? I think it's over here. Yeah. Let me go back out there. I did not see shit over there. Oh, not wait. What? Weren't we just here? I feel I feel like we were just here and it wasn't there. Maybe I'm crazy. Oh yeah, come on. Isn't it? Okay. Go to the outer wall. Whoa. I don't think that's it, but that's a nice light show. No, bugger off. I got more important things to do than kill you guys for like the dozen dozenth time. Alright, I think there's a break in the wall back here. We don't need no education. We don't need no art control. Dark sarcasm in the glad room. Oh, wait a minute. I think maybe. Oh, hey, guys. What's up? Oh, hey. Party. Oh, There we go. See, I used it. I used my tab. I think it was over there. Damn it. It keeps, like, saying, like, oh, you can use your that abil blood ability. I'm like, okay, cool. I'm going to use it now. It's like, oh, psych. No, you don't have enough points. It's like, wait a minute. No, that's not it. See, the outer wall. Yeah, this makes me think this is probably not it. It's just a regular. Yeah, this is a minor one. I'm closing it anyway because it pissed me off. All right, it said to the outer wall. So I thought I was going to the right spot. But then I saw those enemies that come out of the leaks, and I was like, wait a minute. Maybe that is where we need to go. There's uh, the bone house. I could show you my dark secret. Hello, madam. Escaped spectral geist. How do those things die so quick? They're like at hat. Like that keeps happening with those. They're like half health, and all of a sudden they're like, "Wow, oh my gosh, I'm dead. This is kind of lame." <laughs> the animation stops too. That always throws me off. Like he's still sealing it or doing whatever. But he just like stands there staring dully like I do. Okay. Is that it? I mean, I see that it says defeat Academy Wraith. But I I see no Academy Wraith. I don't think it was that thing I just beat. Oh, hey, Academy Wraith. How you doing? Look, I'm stuck over here, so you're just going to have to, like, meet me somewhere because... Wow. 
later. High five! Insmith Academy holds some of our most significant occult documents. We're talking special characters that not even Kasani can control plus on her keyboard. What? We're still trying to prioritize what requires ASAP recovery. Okay, I get that. For now, do what you can to keep the walls from bleeding out. Seriously, you do not want to get blood on ancient summoning texts. Fun fact, I had this kind of anime tech built into my Hummer. You should see the looks when my baby springs a leak. Nope, God damn it. Gotta do the right order every time. Nice, level 10. It's halfway up there to the next level, which we definitely won't be able to do for quite a while. Speaking of things that are level 10, just about everything. Critical empowerment results. Nice, I always like to hear that. And that's all we got. All right, back into the university. Let's see what other quests we can get. Actually, how are we doing on this quest? We need one more side mission. And I think it said one more main mission. I screwed my keys up on that, something fierce. So I wonder if now that we've finished the quest, will that anima shit like stop? Oh god, fuck off. I think it's time for y'all shit. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. I just wanna get where I'm going. That's the problem too, is like there's so many like huge bunches of enemies. It's like, oh God, I just I just want to get where I'm going. I don't want to fight you guys for like the 500th time. I just kind of want to, because this game's got a ton of backtracking. Like, I don't think I've ever played an MMO with like this much backtracking in it. It is insane. Which is why it's so weird that you can't grab more than one quest at a time. So you basically like this, We've had to make this run, like, how many times now? All right, let's just kill this shit. We're going to have a trillion mobs on us by the time we get through the doors. But yeah, like, you just have to make the same run over and over and over again. Which isn't too bad, but, like, having to re-kill the mobs over and over again, that does get really old. It's kind of one of those things that compounds on itself, right? The combat is like, meh. It's very meh. There's like, it's not awful, but it's not great either. It's basically run in, spam your AEs as fast as you can, and then move on. So combine that with having to keep running through the same areas over and over and killing the same enemies over and over. It's like, ugh. like if the combat with system was interesting, it wouldn't be so bad, right? Because you could just. Uh, it could be fun to clear, like, clear all the stuff yes. out. But in this, it's kind of like, ah, I'm just killing it to get you out of the way. The Breakfast Cult. That was, that was a good movie until the end. That movie, The ending of Breakfast Club was so bad. So bad. Most of the ancient wards that protect Innsmouth Academy have been disabled. Familiars are running free, and predators are entering and leaving the academy grounds. The wards feed on enema and must be reactivated in order to control the chaos and protect the island. The wards in and around the academy must be reactivated. Pick up the anima manipulator from the nearby desk and examine the functioning wards at the office door. Then test and make sure the familiar is being kept out. Did you come for the library amnesty? Regrettably, our alumni schedule for the semester has been heavily impacted by the massacre. Slaughter is a crotch, an unfortunate crotch. I presided as Innsmouth's headmaster over a run of good form for 15 years. Naturally, there have been the usual accidents, maimings, well within accountable risks. As I would tell parents before I was retired from the reparation committee, you cannot vivisect a ghoul without breaking a few legs. Ah, uh, he's paraphrasing. Work with me here, H.J. Moving right along. 
The wards of this school, hundreds of years old, are violated. It is unthinkable. But we handle the unthinkable every day. Now things are slipping through, both ways. I'm not sure which is worse for the general health of the island. A thorough investigation will follow as soon as we have appointed new staff and dissolved their predecessors' corpses. <coughs> yes, the immediate concern is that the wards must hold. The devices are hungry, rapacious for anima. Great. We'll have a sacrificial donation drive. Or a bake sale. Delightful. He's like, God, yes, a bake sale sounds so wonderful right now. Actually, a bake sale does sound pretty wonderful right now, to be fair. All right. Oh, damn it. Fine, we'll take this again. No, not the black crow. Black crow, you are in the fucking way. Nope, come on. Hi there. There we go. Quick access inventory updated. Please inventory. It's inventory, British people. Please. <sighs> Learn the English language. I know you guys are struggling. You've been scarred since we left you, but move on. Lure familiars close to confirm the ward's work. Okay. Like these. I don't know if he'll come this close. If I had to do one's inside. Come on. He probably won't reset, actually. Reattacking him. I don't know if that actually helps. There we go. Haha, <laughs> yes! We get to intentionally draw these guys into inst instant death? Shit, yeah. Hell, I'd do that for, f for fun. Haha, <laughs> yes. And they're still swinging. Creepily. They can't even, like, die not creepily. Weirdos. Uh, sh yes, shift two. Lure familiar is close to confirm the word's work. Oh, okay. Use an enema shard to restore the east gate. Okay, gotcha. But yeah, I'm wondering if, like, when we do this, less enemies will be in the area? Probably not. Especially since all quests are technically repeatable in this game. Do not have the required items, so I guess we need a shard. So I guess we have to make the shard by drawing it out of these guys again. It is nice the seemingly rare time I get to use single target spells. I didn't drop one. Because the ward's not active. Hey, track and field. You look super angry. Yeah, when they do that scream, that's when the ears always show up. Okay. Let's just read the quest. The wards at the office work. Time to restore the rest. The wards can be temporarily powered with enema shards. Use the manipulators to assemble the shards from the enema contained within familiars. Be sure to test them to make sure they're okay. So yes, we do need to get those shards, but for whatever reason, this one here didn't have those. Oh, hey. We should. Enema shards, boys. So does it always take five to make one? Let's just try it now, see what happens. It might say, like, you need five. You only have two, stupid. Did you not remember what you just did? Yeah, okay. So I think it was five. This one just randomly running around. That's three. 
I'm trying to combine it every time, just to just to see, just in case. Oh, hey, what are you guys? Doing? Oh, running back to the thing. I see. I don't think these drop. Them. No, they don't. So I think we need one more. Oh no, that was enough. All right, now we should be able to go activate it. <laughs> she hates fireworks. I mean, I don't really like fireworks. I don't really care. Like, I'm too cool to care. Ah. Okay. Ooh. Again, drawing our symbol just everywhere. All right, let's find us some familiars. Normally, the damn things are everywhere. I don't think those would count. Ah, hey. There you are. Come on. Come on over here. We'll fight over here. There we go. Alright, one second. I can grab the food. Okay. So now we need to go. I'm back, am I? Yeah, I should be unmuted. Uh, so, I want to finish this quest up before we wrap this. Well, I say we'll stop the screen. Like I say, I definitely plan on coming back to get some more Secret World in. I'm kind of planning on tonight being the last session. We'll see how far we get. Like I said, I don't really have a good set firm like okay when we hit this mark we're gonna wrap her up but I feel like we've got a pretty good taste of what the game's about and it is very interesting it's definitely different than a lot of, uh, of other MMOs that's for sure in many of those ways being good ways I like their focus on story and lore and all that stuff I definitely like that that's one of the main reasons I want to play Final Fantasy uh, thir thir 14? Damn it, I can never remember which one the M is the MMO. But I've heard it's got a good story. Come on. Keep forgetting, you gotta be. Wow, 394. Nice. 401, holy cow. Them crits, son. All right, so those confirmed do not drop. I thought some of them did, though. Ah, there's one. I think we only need one more. But the problem is I feel like Final Fantasy would be really boring for a, a stream. Because there's not, like, standard... Like, there's a story quest... My understanding is it has the standard story quest, but it doesn't have, like, you know, you, you go to an area, do a bunch of quests, whatnot. You do that until, like, level 30, and then you just kind of run out of quests. And then you do, which are, I guess, roughly the equivalent of dailies, just over and over, even though they're not really dailies. But, yeah. And no voice acting makes it kind of suck to do for a... Uh, for a series. How did I do this before? Shit. 
Oh, that's right. I had to go in the inventory and do it. Alright. Find a hapless victim. There's some hapless victim. Ah, here we go. Here's your closer. Those other ones might not even follow that, follow that far. Come on. I still love the noises those things make. They're so weird and creepy. Alright, we need to just restore the drained wards by the Northern Academy entrance. Hmm, okay. So it sounds like we're changing it a little bit. Restore the, how do we restore them? I assume probably the same thing. Collecting those essences. Okay. I was going to say, please don't make me test them. Which I say that after I was like, ah, oh, yeah, I love pulling them in here. Which, yeah, okay, fair enough. I'd actually would have had no problem testing it. It's funny to watch to pull all them in and zap them. Kind of like in, uh, what was it called? Dying Light? Like bringing them into the base, bring them into those uh, basically the black lights. They wouldn't quite go in, I don't think. I think you could maybe trick them into going in or push them in. I don't really remember, but I think that like instantly vaporized them, or either that or just did a ton of damage. Because I remember cheesing quite a few that way. Can't make another one. So, let's harvest some on the way. How many do we have? We have four. I think we said we needed four, right? Nope, I guess it is five. I must have had like a fifth one just, or a Another one sitting around the first time I did them. Alright. Hello. Get wrecked. I was going to grab them all just in case I need more of them later. Gotta make them first. Uh, okay, there it goes. Wow, that was weird. Activate the ward in the library. Ah, this is what we kept seeing people do, I bet. Like fighting, doing that big uh, beam of light in the library. Let's do this thing. Dun, 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 So I wonder how you, uh, how you regenerate that tab healing. The bottom left there. I wonder how that works. Come on, keep my corruption up. Come on, hurry up. The nice thing is using thing about using that shield is it it uh, it brings your corruption up, and then you can like, get some nukes in while you're doing more damage, and then it drops it as soon as the corruption is over. What? No passive health regen. I guess we're still technically in combat. Oh, hey. We're going to use Chaos to try to get plus. To help with the healing. Heh. <laughs> nice. 
Oh, I bet you could even run them into the wards. Maybe? Well, maybe the wards that are actually up, anyway. Ah, yeah, see, they're trying to come in through those, and those are up. That's pretty cool. Get it? Rock already. Thank you. coming at me. Apparently the wards aren't working that great. I love HJ. We interfaced on a video conference meet and greet once. Dude has his ruthless ducks in a row. You could take some notes. Anyway, the school campus we kind of inherited from the bad old days. Back when they expected Black Magic to do a bleeding edge containment grids job. You can find this stuff all over the country. Our forefathers just throwing up wards like gang signs. Sometimes it holds, sometimes some guy laying cables gets his face melted and it's DEF CON time. Because of this, these ones hold at least until the military cluster bombs the place. Good job. That's the only kind of job I know how to do. Alright. Let's oh no, not that. I'm gonna upgrade that. Just because it matched to get more uh, more out of it. The most efficient. Oh, we got a three dot chain. That's pretty cool. Damn it. See, that's the thing is, I don't know if it's worthwhile to like now start upgrading this one instead. Probably again, probably not. I'm overthinking this because we're not gonna like play this in the long term. So it's not really important. We micromanage our our gear, right? Like I'm trying to keep it up to date, but I'm not worried. That you know, 40 hours from now, I didn't bone myself, right? Actually, wait, yeah. Okay. Critical empowerment results. Damn it, critical, and it still didn't get a level. That's okay. Okay. Oh wow, with the Sonic, and it was busy. I love Sonic. <laughs> 